What's up, my name is Technobo here for Troubleshoot and welcome back to another quick guide. In this video, I'll be showing you how to enable dragging and dropping files onto Python files in Windows. If I make a new folder here, then simply create any random file on here, as well as a new text document that I'll name, say, test.py, you'll see that if I try and drag any file onto test.py, it won't work properly. The only way that you can do this is by running, say, test.py, space followed by whatever name of the file you want to drag onto it. This is effectively what dragging and dropping files onto EXEs does, but it doesn't work with Python files. How do we enable this? Well, it's really simple. In the description down below, you'll find a bit of text. Simply copy it, then right-click in the folder, hover over New, and choose Text Document. We'll be naming it, say, install.reg, getting rid of .txt. That's very important. If you don't see .txt and after hitting enter, it doesn't change the icon or ask you to say yes to changing the file type, you'll need to enable file name extensions. In Windows 10, head across to view at the very top and enable file extensions. On Windows 11, click the three dots here, choose options, and in this window, view at the very top, then untick hide extensions for known file types and click OK. When it's done, right-click the .reg file that we just created and paste in the command from the description down below. Hit Ctrl S to save and close out of this. Then we'll double-click on this reg file and click yes when prompted for admin. Then choose yes once again and OK. Now, whenever we try and drop a file onto a Python file, it won't work just yet. With a folder browser open, you'll need at least one of them. If not, hit Start and E to open up a new one. We'll be opening the Task Manager with Ctrl Shift and Escape. Then we'll locate Windows Explorer over here, right-click it and choose Restart. Then all of the file browsers on your computer will close and we can open up a folder. There we go. Now we can drag a file onto Python files and as you can see, it says copy. Awesome, it worked. A quick note for those who are trying to do this for PYC files as well and PYW files, you can swap out python.file in the command for python.noconfile, capital N, C, F, and python.compiled file, capital C, capital F. You'll find both of these in the description down below as well. Now, for those who want to be a bit nerdy, if you'd like to actually use this, we can simply just import sys, then you'll have an array of arguments. I'll type in for arg in sys.argv. This is the array, print arg as such, and we'll have input press any key to continue to close the window. There we go. I'll save it and drag any number of files onto the Python file. And as you can see, the zeroth argument here is the actual file itself, the Python file, followed by every other file that we dragged and dropped onto it. Pretty simple. If you'd ever like to remove this, simply open up your registry editor, hit start, type in reg edit, and open regedit.exe. Inside of here, we can navigate into hkey classes root, python.file, shell x, and drop handler, drop handler here. We can simply right click this and choose delete to get rid of this action. Pretty simple. But anyways, that's really about it for this quick video. Thank you all for watching. My name's been taking over here for Troubleshoot and I'll see you all next time. Ciao.